I think we're slowly gonna get there. <laughs> okay, so let me see. Actually, we're gonna have to make sure that this is all connected. Okay, so this is not gonna collapse. Then, bam, we can remove it. Very good, I like it. And then we can put the shenanigans underneath. Very good. Greetings, guys and girls, fellow gamers. My name is Games Cakes, and welcome back to Smarter Days to Die. We're playing Seven Days to Die Modded, and we're back with War of the Walkers Season 2. We have been getting sidetracked with Undead Legacy a little bit. I wanted to get the three episodes out, so thank you very much for not giving me a hard time about it. And in fact, actually, thank you so much that you guys are actually liking it. You seem to be really into it, so we got to add it to our rotation, and um, we'll see what we're going to do. Look at my little farm over there. So I forgot completely what I was doing. So I think we got our builder stuff, so we got to look at some of the building stations that we hopefully can build, and I have some plans with the base to maybe add a little bit something that makes it different this will be our last line of defense if they break through here this is where we have our last stand but i want to start building a little bit around it like you know to, to make something out of it but anyway i also lowered the days to 90 minutes that we move on a little bit faster and put ourselves a little bit more under pressure so less talking less of the waffle i hope you guys are gonna enjoy the episode if you do remember to kick that like button in the balls to support the channel and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see hit that subscribe button so let's get started all right thank you so much guys by the way for the comments on some of the ideas for the design it's really really amazing i'm loving it yeah so we actually i i couldn't figure out how to get rid of this big block here of these yeah this one here and um you guys have actually helped me out a lot with that and i show you now I just have to destroy that part in the middle here. Um, it's not going to drop because of the uh, pillars. Now, I was going to make very skinny poles, uh, pillars, yeah, because I really like the 50, I think they're 50 mils or something like 50, 50 pillars, yeah. So, but we can't make them out of wood. So the only thing out of wood we can make is the centered poles. So I decided to use them. And it is looking different, absolutely, but I think it will do because it means we can put them close to each other and don't feel like they're intrusively in the way, if you know what I mean. I don't think they're visually kind of just really are bad. I don't think so. Okay, let me just destroy these guys here. And then build them back up. There we go, nice. And now everything looks the same. Now, um, as I said, the plan is to have this as a last resort defense, yeah? And we are going to take out the walls. We are going to make concrete now because we can make concrete, which is absolutely fantastic. I queued up um, while I was working at the end of the last episode. I was working, finishing off some things, and I queued up a cement mixer. So now that we have a cement mixer, which we can just, I don't know. Oh, actually, we, mm, I don't know if I want to put them in the corner. I think we're going to put boxes in the corner because... We have one more machine which can fit here. I think it's only two. The machine is at one or two. If it's one, then we're going to fit two more here and one more here and boxes here. So let's put the... Let's put it over here. Okay, for now. End of story. So concrete mix is something we can make now, which is really nice. Now, we also can make the special benches now, our stations. Let me see. So the armor smithing station, we can do that as well now. We need an anvil and we need 50 forged iron, which we should be able to get together. Now the gunsmithing workstation we still have unlocked and the blueprint workstation we have unlocked. But we learned the... What did we learn? We learned one of the stations. Was it... Oh, it was the advanced workbench, I think. Was it the advanced workbench? The builder's workbench. Excellent. Yes, the builder's workbench is what we had. Oh, I completely got lost there for a second. So we need an anvil, which we can make here. So we have we have metal in here, don't we? Yeah, okay. And we have stone in here. So let's make an anvil. There we go. And let's craft up some more cement. I'm trying to get my bearings, guys, okay? So I'm trying to see, um, uh, to see where everything is again. And oh, look at that. We actually have some sand here. That's not a lot of sand. But we have all the forged iron we need which is good and we have more spikes here so i was i was actually more prepared than i thought okay so here we go here we're gonna have more cement coming in very nice i'm loving it i oh, love it and more cement please excellent okay Here's the anvil. And let's see, builder's workbench. We have everything. Well, we need 50, we have that. We need 20 electrical uh, parts, which I should have in here. 
Let me see. Oh, yeah. We, <laughs> yeah. I think we got 20. I think we got 20. There we go. And we need six short iron pipes, which we should have in here as well. And we have wood, we have the anvil, we have the claw hammer. Now, claw hammer, we can make a new one. We can use the old uh, broken one here for the craft. So let's do the builder's workbench. We can only make that in the workbench. Okay. Nice. Okay, now. This is going to take some time to do. And in the meantime, I'm... Oh, we have to clean up a little bit. We're going to have to make another uh, hammer. I suppose I can use this one in the meantime until I crafted a new one. So let me see here. Hammer. Claw hammer. Excellent. Do I have any more toolsmithing? Oh, look at that. Oh, we don't have 12 points. Okay, that's no problem. That's no problem. Do we have any recipes to level up our toolsmithing? That's our weaponsmithing. And armor smithing. Okay, we can level that up a little bit. Nice. I'm so totally triggering everybody now. I put, I put the workbench here. I, I just want to keep the, keep it there. End of story. Okay, so now we need to make some tools, I believe. Okay, let's see what we can do. Can we make some rebar? Where's this? We need to make some rebar, which we need a bender for. And to make basic rebar, we can do that in the forge? All right. Okay, let's make 250 just to see what it's like. Okay, now to make the actual rebar, we need a bender. And that is nothing we can craft, it seems. So a bender is something we are going to have to buy in the trader or um, actually an armor smithing bench. I, I, th I should be able to do that as well. Yeah, I think we should craft that as well, the armor smithing workbench. We shouldn't waste any time. So let's uh, queue it up. It's one more anvil. Let's um, do one more anvil here. And then a couple of more pipes and uh, we're good to go. Excellent. And 15 electrical parts. Nice. Okay. So we have everything we need. Now, of course, we don't have a bender. We don't have any of these machines now. I don't think I picked any of those things up either here. No, I don't think so. But at least we don't know what to look out for, which is really, really handy. And um, we can bring it back home when we find it, if we find it. So it seems to be a bit RNG, but hopefully the trader will have a good spot for that. Okay, we have a roaming horde coming in. Let's take care of them. And it's a screamer as well. There we go, nice. Don't destroy anything. There we go. We finished the quest, completed, level up, okay. Must have been just a normal side quest. I thought it was one of the class quests, like, but it, it didn't seem to be the case. Also, yes, we want to put um, <laughs> these spikes here. I suppose what we're going to do here is we're going to put more spikes on top all the way around because we do want it to be kind of flush. So we're going to have to do that. There we go, nice. And... Oh, lovely. Actually, here we can put already the rebar frame, uh, the rebar down. And... There we go. Probably should upgrade this as well.
Gonna upgrade all of this to concrete and then maybe reinforce concrete. It's it, we see how much we have left because in the moment I don't even have enough sand to actually make uh, that many concrete mix. So we're gonna have to find some sand. I think there's a desert somewhere nearby here, of course. I just forget which map I'm playing. Um, yeah, over here. There we go. Yeah, loads of desert. So why do I not have a lot of sand? If there was sand there, why, why am I not having a lot of sand? Because I was checking out everything upstairs and I was looking for sand and I couldn't find any. Maybe I put it in a special box or something, I don't know. Like there was 26 sand, or so yeah, 21 sand, some redonkulous numbers. So I'm crafting a serious amount of sand here, but um, that takes forever. Where is my sand? That doesn't have sand. Oh, there, genie, maca balls. Yes, thank you very much. We can stop this now. Holy balls. Okay, concrete mix instead. Yes, there we go. That's that's what I wanted. That's what I was looking for. Yes, baby. Look at that. Nice, lovely. Okay, this is actually the roaming horde. The other one was only screamers. Yeah, and we got a couple of interesting characters in there as well. It's a nice mixed horde, actually, for a change. Ah, no touches. There we go, nice. Let's keep it on the arrows, we have very little stamina left. Don't walk away. There we go, nice. And the next one. Love it. Okay. Yeah, the big guy, we're gonna have some problems. Okay, now I think we can go back to our um, melee weapon. There we go. There we go, nice. Oh! We're doing well, we're doing well. Nice! That was actually pretty satisfying. That was nice. It was enough to be able to make mistakes and potentially get chewed up. Oh, we found another fragment. That's also why we want to kill them. Like, we want to find the fragments, you know, as soon as possible. So let's see what fragment we found. Maybe it's one that we need. There we go. Thank you. Come on. Switch. Yeah, nice. Oh. Okay, bit of glue and oil. That's always needed. Ah, there was nothing in there anyway. There we go. Nice. Okay, so let's see what the fragment was about. If it's something we need or if it's just another duplicate. What do we have here? Covert class. And it's already something we have. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, can't do anything about that. Um, we got a plastic cup. I don't know what we need it for. A cosmetic item found in the world. Good for scrapping or selling. Requires to do it yourself perk. Okay, yeah, we can actually scrap that then in that case. All right, and we're now able to make wet concrete. Now, we have to do it on the workbench, which is a bit of a pain in the ass. But <laughs> it's uh, better than nothing. There we go. Nice, and this here is gonna work perfectly. We're going to put half blocks actually down here, pretty much like the ones I have on me in the moment, but um, I'm gonna take the whole the whole ground out. Look at that, nice, love it. And then we're gonna have the half blocks here, which let me see if I can make the half blocks out of wood, because that's what I kind of want to make them out of. There we go. Is the auger not going to be faster? Ah, uh, not for that. We need the we need the chainsaw for that. Sad, sadly, it's not going to be enough. 
And we don't want them to dig underneath. So we definitely want to dig out this here and put a concrete floor down. So we have the rebar frame, so we should be doing okay. Let me see. We have a shovel here. We're going to need that as well. There we go. Let's just do this little corner here first. Oh, yes, we're nearly one-shotting it. Absolutely fantastic. So, can we do minus 69er then? Was that going to help us one-shot things? Ah, 25 points. That is a lot. It's like insanely a lot. Okay, there we go. Look at that. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And we're nearly level 73, which is really nice. Excellent. Okay, so let's put this here. Ooh. And that is literally so nobody can dig underneath. Now, I queued up a lot of gunpowder actually in the mortar and pestle, which is quite handy. I didn't know that, uh, and I didn't realize that until. Um, it's funny, I was playing Darkness Falls on stream, and I realized in the mortar and pestle we can make gunpowder, and I just checked it here, and we can do that here as well. So I wonder if that is a vanilla thing, or if that's just something mods do in general. Um, oh, no, in vanilla, there is no mortar and pestle, is there? I don't know. I don't remember. This is so terrible when you play like uh, modded for so long. You don't remember anymore what was in vanilla and what was in what is in modded. Okay, we're gonna need two more of those just so we can finish these guys here. There we go. Nice. And now we can do this. Look at this. This is awesome. Oh man, this is gonna be nice. This is how it's meant to be. Exactly. Exactly how it's meant to be. Oh, whoa, it takes forever to upgrade. <laughs> oh, man, I think we have a steel hammer, but even the steel hammer takes this long. I don't see the improvement of the steel hammer. Let's actually see. Um, we're going to have to take up the concrete uh, poles here as well. And let's just see. I think there's a steel hammer here somewhere. Hang on. Did we not have a steel hammer here? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna, we have some visitors. Let's take the steel here for a second, see if we can fix this. Repair, excellent. And let's see if that's going to be faster to upgrade. Oh, I thought we had a horde. It was just probably one, one little zombie, was it? And where did it get stuck? I don't even see. Okay, whatever. Don't care. <laughs> so let's see if this is going to be faster and upgrading. So this is three, four, five, six. And this one is two, three, four, five. Okay. It's a little bit faster, and you mean, I mean like a little bit. Yeah, we still have a lot of cobblestone um, left over anyway, so we can upgrade these. And then we need approximately, let me see. Ooh, we already have the bottom row done for that, so let me just finish this on the top here. Where's our, there we go. Okay. All right, this is reinforced concrete now. Excellent. And oh, we already here as well. We Genie Mac, we already went like loads. Oh, here we go. We have to waste some iron. There we go. Nice. Well, that's going to save us some materials as well, which is really, really nice. So, oh, it was an accident. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, nice. We leveled up to 73. Now, um, I made the builder's workbench. And the builder's workbench, uh, while it lets us do a lot, it we need some of the tools. So we're going to have to visit the trader every now and then to see if we can get the tools. Or maybe even our builder class vending machine might be giving us these as well. Who knows? We might get lucky. So what is actually left to do down here on the inside? Well, I consider that the inside, even if it's the wall. But um, we have left to do one, two, three, four, five. And then this is the corner. And then we have six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 
13, 14, 15, 16, 17, about 20, 34? Oh, we might actually have enough between that and this. We probably have enough. That is awesome. This is a lot of work. It's very slow. It's not actually the amount of work um, as such. It's just the speed at which you are just not progressing. Everything is so slow. Our tools are just not the high speed bam, 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 bam tools yet. Everything is just like so tediously slow. Um, like our axe, for example, takes three hits to get through a block. So you can see how it's like just very, very monotone. Monotrain, monotrain, monorail, 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 monorail. Spring field. <laughs> oh man, okay, so. We're gonna have to replace you as well, dude. We're gonna have to replace you as well. And these beauties as well, we're gonna have to replace them as well. And we're gonna have to place reinforced concrete underneath all of that. Well, maybe only on the sides. I don't know. Maybe we're gonna do reinforced concrete here on the in the like two rows around, and then the rest just wood or something. I don't know. That would make sense. Okay, so how are we looking at um, the front here? That is actually not bad. Okay, these guys here. Oh, nice. So slow. Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> There we go. Come on. Oh, and we're out of cobblestone. We need 20 more cobblestone rocks. 20. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, we need a, we need a couple more. So do we have um, some clay? I think we have loads of clay. We have like a hundred or sorry. We have like thousands of clay. Well, that's what happens. You see, now I can't get up because I'm like, Ugh! There we go. Look at that. Did you see that mighty jump? That was absolutely amazing. That was so awesome. Like the zombies outside going like, dude, what the hell? Better not mess with this guy. <laughs> okay, cobblestone. Let's make three first. There we go. And that's 10. And oh, that's very fast. I like it. Okay, let's. Oh, no. <laughs> no, we only need about 190. I would say 200 should be enough. And it's pretty fast. So is there anything else we're going to need to pick up? Let's stay on favorites because it takes forever to open. Ah, you balls, you. There we go. Do we have any more reinforced concrete? No concrete mix. Sorry, we have now 770. That's only 77. So we definitely can't upgrade all of these. But we can certainly upgrade the ones we already have out. Yeah, and these guys, they're just going to get replaced. End of story. There is absolutely no way I'm going to bother wasting all my metal on upgrading them. I mean, that's just wood. That's gonna go. Period. <sighs> okay. Come on. I also made a uh, centered pole. So you probably looked at it earlier and said, "Dude, why did he make centered poles?" Yeah, they're burning in the in the forge. I actually had to make. Uh, I made forty normal poles after that. I can't believe I did that. I'm such an idiot sometimes. Okay, let me see. We still have enough iron left, so we should be okay. I think we have 9,000 or something. Well, 8,400. Oh, balls. I don't even know if I want to upgrade these. So don't upgrade these, you moppet. So it's coming along nicely, though. I have to say now, the outside is something we're still going to have to work on. But I think we're going to get all of this finish before the 14-day horde. So that should be interesting. And Molotov cocktails are making loads of um, gunpowder. So we should be able to make some pipe bombs, hopefully. Let me see. Pipe bombs. Yeah, I made loads of gunpowder. We have plant fiber. Oh, man, this is going to be awesome. And I made like about 600 gunpowder or something. So if you look at... Uh, there we go. Yeah, 633. That is absolutely fantastic. So we can already start queuing up. Uh, pipe bombs, so we have them. Okay, look at this. This is awesome. So they take 10 uh, plant fiber. Yeah, we have like loads. Okay, look like loads and Short iron pipes. Here we go. Nice Does it require less maybe here? No, 
Still the same. Uh, we don't need 60. So what I think we need on pipe bombs is... I would say 30 is good for the moment. And that should last the night, definitely. So we should get a couple of guys nicely huddling up and then kaboom. So we have all this down. What about Molotov Cocktail? Molotov Cocktails. Okay, gas cans. We have loads of gas cans. Oil and glass jars. So we have loads of glass jars here. Glass jars. Five. Okay. Ugh. Okay, we can make some more. Do we have some glass in here? I think one of them has glass. Excellent. Okay, we're going to make some jars. How many jars can we make? 200. Okay, let's make 100 jars. Okay, because that will definitely be worth it. And look at this. Only nine minutes. This is going to be awesome. So, and then we have... Where are my... Where's my oil? I think my oil is up here. Look at this. This is so cool. So we can actually make how many? Ah, oh, only two. Why? Oh, the cloth fragments. Okay, so we have more cloth fragments here. And now 37. Look at this. This is awesome. And I think we already have two somewhere in here. Where did I see them? I saw them somewhere. Don't be... There we go. Love it. Okay, we don't need this actually anymore. And I might actually use this instead of the other one. I think this one is stronger. Keep using this though. Hmm. Okay, let's repair and then see. All right, Molotov cocktails. I might as well see if I can queue them up here. Um, let's make 25. 25 should be enough. And actually, 25 pipe bombs should be enough as well. So if we're gonna do pipe bombs, we're gonna make another 15. There we go. And that also means that we're going to have a lot of resources left over. So, oh, 25. I meant 23. Excellent. Look at that. We're getting organized. Molotov cocktails, pipe bombs, all that jazz that I usually ignore. And you know what? Let's just top it off. To top it off that I'm paying attention, iron chest armor. How do you like them apples? Okay. Okay. Actually, I'm going to have to make sure that I can actually... Craft good armor. Um, iron armor? Chest armor? I don't know. Armor crafting. We're at six. So, yes, 350. That's good enough for the moment. Awesome. Okay, so we can do that. And I think that's the only one we can craft so far. I haven't learned any of the other recipes yet. But it's the next morning. So maybe our these guys have to respawn? No, restock on day 16. So they don't restock daily. Interesting. I did not know that, that they didn't restock daily. Oh, look at that. Here we have some really, really nice um, stuff. But we can't sell anything to these guys, which is kind of a pain. And, um, yeah, because I don't know where I have my money. I don't think I have any money left after last time. Yes, I don't have any money left. I think I spent it all on nonsense or I don't know what I spent it on. Here's the generator bank. Okay, we're going to put an engine in there that's going to give us some power. Wait, did I not have a lot of money? I thought I did. I think we're slowly going to get there. <laughs> okay, so let me see. Actually, we're going to have to make sure that this is all connected. Okay, so this is not going to collapse. Then, bam, we can remove it. Very good. I like it. And then we can put the shenanigans underneath. Very good. Same here. The ladder should be able to hold it. Nah, let's not rely on the ladder. Let's um, do it properly. There we go. And another one here. Come on. And one more here. All right, so now we can safely take these guys away. Nice. Um, I think we might have the uh, the Reba frames. Let's do the side first. Nice. We're leveling up so much. It is absolutely fantastic. The digging alone, I think, leveled me up nearly the whole level. And we're still going to have to put some underneath the spikes outside. I know that. I'm aware of that. But, oh, hello. What's happening here? There we go. Straighten up some ground. Um, I don't know why I did that. We don't really have to do it. There we go. Nice. And let's upgrade these guys.
And we might as well put these guys down. I mean, if we don't have the reinforced concrete now, we're gonna have it uh, before the day 14 horde. So it shouldn't be a waste. And this is all the rebar I bought in the trader. So, haha, <laughs> in your face game, don't need to wait until rebar. I have about 750 rebar, whatever it is, the resources we need. So, yeah, once we can make rebar frames, which I think we still need to unlock. Huh. Metal? I don't remember where it was. Let me see. Scrap iron, iron door crafting, tungsten steel tool crafting. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it was from... Oh, I don't actually know where it is. That is insane. Well, it doesn't matter. I'm going to finish this up here now. And hopefully we can upgrade it all. I'm going to see how much more uh, reinforced... Uh, no, sorry, not reinforced. Concrete mix we have upstairs baking. And um, we should have about 500 more, which between that and... 232 it might just be enough who knows and that is the last thing we have to really upgrade fully i think oh no we're gonna have to do these guys here and oh whoopsie daisy i forgot completely about this guy here but we have the resources so i'm not really too worried about it so there we go let's copy rotation Nice. Anything else missing? Anything else on cobblestone? Yeah, 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 yeah. We have these guys still sitting on cobblestone. Yeah, let's not waste our reinforced... Um, <laughs> let's not waste our concrete mix on that. There we go. Nice. Ah, your balls. Okay. Is that it? Is it all upgraded now to... At least, um, concrete. Okay, we have this gap here as well. No copy rotation. Nice. And two more here. This is sweet. So this is coming together really, really, really nicely. I'm loving it. I'm absolutely loving it. So let's see. Oh, I'm going to have to put another one there. How many more we have? We have 363 and we probably should queue up some more. Yes, let's do it. Bam. And end, end of story. I nearly said end of the <laughs> day. Mixing a little bit of my German in there. Anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. Um, this is pretty amazing that we actually had the resources for that. We got a lot of work done. I did a lot of off-camera grind in between. So um, the waffle that is in it um, kind of had to be in it. Otherwise, I would have cut out way too much. And I would have sat here probably for more than another two hours. Like, so... Oh, I hope you guys like where I'm going with this. This is going to be only the initial design. This is going to be the... Well, we're probably going to use this design for the day 14 horde. But after that, it's just a matter of fixing it up, putting down um, the spikes, and then we're going to expand out. I want to have from the ceiling that I have all the way on the top, I want to have staircases going down all the way on all sides. So we can go to like kind of immediate platform that connects them to towers on all four sides. So we're gonna make a tower out of this guy here and um, we're going to also make uh, towers here and here, but they will be hollowed so we can actually go in and out of them. And um, this will just not be hollow. I, I suppose we can dig it out. We can do it in hindsight, we'll see. It's just gonna be a lot of um, auger work. Anyway, let me stop wasting time. Let's upgrade all as much as we can. Let's start with the outside and then work our way inside um, so we have the weak stuff on the inside and not on the outside. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, remember to kick that like button in the balls. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. <sighs> I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, feel Spaß and happy gaming. Okay, we're going to have to wait for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. We need about 300 more um, concrete makes. So they're crafting upstairs. So we definitely will have enough. In the meantime, the ones we already have upgraded, we can start putting these guys down. There you go. Look at that. This is this is awesome. This is kind of this is coming together so nicely. Okay, we actually can repair these. The ones we smacked. There we go.